One slow day at a time, we will make Draft Champions great again. Now that that's out of my system, I do want to say thank you. I'm surprised you guys showed so much love on the last draft video. And today, I can only draft the player if I know exactly how old they are. Granted, I'm gonna be using Wikipedia for this information, okay? And I know your teacher wouldn't be proud of me. So I'm gonna build the best team that I can, only using players whose ages I definitely know. And do coaches count in this? How would I know how old these dudes are? I'm going with Matt Nagy, because why not? Kelvin Beecham, Daniil Hunter, Maurice Hurst. Hunter's kind of old. I don't know what you would consider kind of old, but I'm pretty sure he's like 27. I feel like that's right at the tipping point. 27. Oh, he just turned 27. I'm a god. Gronk is old, and I want Goddard, and Goddard is young. Goddard's gotta be like, oh, how young is he? I'm gonna say 25. Yeah, he's 26. Old ass bitch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How old is Gronk? I'm gonna say 33. I actually don't know though. Ah! He's 32. Oh, he's a Taurus like me, though. His birthday's May 14th on May 4th. We don't care. Let me tell, right, let me tell you. <laughs> we don't care. And the last one is Hunter Henry, 29, 26. All right, I'm a bum. I think if I don't get any of them right, I got to take the worst option. I think Gronk is the worst option here. It's a low sober L, so. Akeem Hicks is old. I feel like I've been hearing the name Akeem Hicks for so long. I'm going to say 31. He's 31 and he turns 32 in a week. I just got bailed out. Let's go. Byron Jones, Devin McCourty, Jabril Peppers. Jabril Peppers has got to be 28. I feel so confident in that. Devin McCourty, how old are you? You're a fossil, bro. You're 30. He's 34? Oh my God. For Byron Jones, he's not that old, but he's still old. I think he's older than Jabril, and Jabril is 26. I'm gonna say Byron Jones is actually 28. He's 29. I think the worst pick here is Byron Jones, though, so we'll have to take Byron Jones. Dude, this is harder than it looks, all right? Hey, and you know what time it is, boys? It's Raid Shadow Legends time. The best game that you could possibly have on your phone. I'm always talking about Raid Shadow Legends, the badass champions, the insane bosses. But today, I want to dive into the true end game content. And that is the Doom Tower. The Doom Tower is basically a gigantic prison. Now, inside this prison is a ton of incredibly powerful monsters that need to be contained from the rest of the world. This was working out pretty well, but right now, the Doom Tower is kind of starting to fall apart luckily people like me and you can go into the doom tower crack some skulls and keep it contained there's nothing i love more than a good boss fight the doom tower's got it and it's nuts and if you want to beat some of the awesome bosses in the doom tower you're gonna need a squad of awesome champions let me show you some of mine recently i've been upgrading ugo she's an awesome support champion and then this is jerojin he's my tank he just soaks up all the hits for my squad plus there's a ton of new stuff in raid right now the big update coming this month is called the guardian ring it gives you loads of new ways to use your champions and a new way to upgrade your favorite champions. Myself and the community are so excited for it. There has never been a better time to start. And if you want a huge head start in raid, all you have to do is hit the link in the top of the description or scan my QR code on screen. You'll get an epic hero, Chanaru, who is awesome in the Doom Tower. 200k silver, one XP boost, one energy refill, and one ancient shard. So you can summon an awesome champion as soon as you get in game. And all this treasure will be waiting for you right here in the top right of your screen at this chest icon. It's that easy. Click the link in the top of the description and I'll see you in game. I'm thinking about saying 30 for Jack Conklin, but since these two dudes were all 27, I'm gonna say 27 for Jack Conklin. He's 27, Jack Conklin. TJ Watt is 27 and I want him. He's gotta be 27. I think I actually know that one. I'm a god. I'm a god of my man. TJ Watt, let's go baby. Lamar, Dak, Justin Fields. Lamar, Lamar Jackson, 24. And that's who I want. January 7th, 1997, Lamar Jackson is 24. Dak Prescott, I wouldn't get you anyway. Justin Fields has got to be 21 almost, right? Or is he 22? I'm going to say Justin Fields is 22. Oh, he is 22 and he's March 5th, 1999. He's 22. He's a little baby. You know what? I'm always using Lamar and I'm always talking shit about Justin Fields. So to appease Bears fans, I am going to go Justin Fields. Sexy running background. How old are Kamara and Cook? How long have they been in the league? I feel like they've been such stud running backs in the league for so long, but they can't, to be as good as they are, they can't be over 28. I think all three of the dudes right here, I think they're all 26. Alvin Kamara, age 26, July 25th. Dalvin Cook age, August 10th, 26 years old. They're just, they're prime running backs. You gotta be somewhere around that age to be a prime running back. I think I want Kamara. I want Kamara. I get the choice here. Dante Jackson, let's say 27, 26. Legereus Sneed is young, 24, 24. I got luxurious need, right? So that's who we're taking. Odell? Odell's washed. We don't have to go there. <laughs> he's gotta be, is he 28? Oh, he's 29. Oh my God. 
Oh, he just, because it was just his birthday. He got released by the Browns on his birthday. I should have known that. I should have known this one. He got released by the Browns on his birthday, November 5th. DJ Moore, I'm gonna say 25, 24. I have to imagine Chase Claypool can't be younger, that much younger, because he's such a beast, but he's very young. I'm gonna say Chase Claypool is 23. Jordan year, just like me. July 7th, 1998. 23 years old, Chase Claypool. A little Mac, Jair Alexander, Shaq Lawson. I already have TJ Watt, so I really want to get Jair Alexander right. And what's crazy to see Jair Alexander in 87 overall is he is young. He's got to be young, bro. There's no way, no shot he's over 25. Jair Alexander is 24. February 9th, 1997, Jair Alexander is 24 years old. I don't got to think about anything else. I knew I wanted him, bro. He's a beast. Quentin Nelson's kind of young, too. Quentin Nelson cannot be over 26. Njoku cannot be over 27. C.D. Lamb cannot be over 24. I'm going to go 23 C.D. Lamb, 26 Njoku, 25 Nelson. Quentin Nelson is 25. Let's go. Njoku is 25. Damn, so I did get that one wrong, but C.D. Lamb could literally be 22, actually. He's 22. That's insane. That's literally insane, dude. He's 22. He's born in 1999. April 8th, 1999. He's almost a 2000s baby. And he's putting up fucking numbers. I think the best pick here is Quentin Nelson. Someone for Kamara to run behind, and it's also the only one we got right. Zach Martin, gotta be 30. He's been in the league for so long. McCaffrey, I'm thinking, is 27. And Michael Thomas is pretty old, too. Michael Thomas might be 27, 28. Martin, is he 30? He is 30 on the shmoney. I could have some a god-tier offensive line. McCaffrey, are you 27? Oh, he's 25. He's way younger than I thought. And Michael Thomas, I said 27. He is 28. So Zach Martin's actually the only one I got right. So I have to go Zach Martin. Most is young. Vita Vea, I don't know. I would love Vita Vea, but I don't know. Buda Baker, also relatively young. I'm going to say 26, 26, 26. One of you has got to be 26. Buda Baker is 25. Vita Vea is 26. Let's go. And Bosa is 24. Youngin, dude. He's so fucking big for that age. Hey, yo, what the f***? All right, but Vita Vea, that's my boy. You guys know I love Vita Vea. Um, I'm going to talk to Urban. Urban Meyer. Laying it down on a 21-year-old. That's my idol. Well, let's look at this squad. Only consisting of players whose age I knew correctly or the worst possible option. Quentin Nelson, Ryan Jensen, Zach Martin, Conklin. We got Gronk, Corey Davis, Bobby Tanyan, Justin Fields, and Kamara. That is a backfield I've definitely never used. I'm excited to. JPP, Bates, TJ Watt, Jamal Adams. Dude, I actually really like this. Team. Come on. No, you didn't! No, you didn't! <laughs> I hate EA so much. Dude, I didn't even get a game in. Wait, what even just happened? Did I just get a loss and now I don't have my team anymore? What a joke. I'm back to the start. Let's see to what degree we can build this team back. All right, well, we know Dalvin Cook. He was 26. Gronk, okay. We're on to something. We had Von Bell from the last one. He was 27. Ooh, I don't know any of these guys. Andre Speed is like 27, 28. I'm gonna say 28. Andre Speed, 28. You know what? Speed run. Age, age, speed run. Jonathan Allen, we got that one right before. Bradley Chubb is young. I'm gonna say Bradley Chubb's 26. He's 25, darn it. We'll take Jonathan Allen then. Dude, Tyler Lockett's getting washed. He's gotta be like, I don't think he's as washed as Thielen, but he's gotta be like 29. 29 on the shmoney. Chandler Jones, we had that before. All right, clean. Justin Fields, welcome back, baby. Sorry, Bears fans, you got clutched up. Chase Claypool, welcome back. This is how shit draft champions is. It's just the same pit of players. Laramie Tunzel, welcome back. Frank Clark is on the last one. Solid. OJ Howard's young, isn't he? 26. I would like him. 26 on the money. Let's go. We got OJ Howard. Jesse Bates, welcome back to the team. Brian Jensen, welcome back to the team. Dante Jackson is 26. Yes, 26. All right, money. Jabril, welcome back, baby. Byron Jones was on the last one. How old's Keenan Allen? Let's say he's 29. Keenan Allen, age 29 years old. Let's go. Uh, Kelsey. How old is Travis? I'm gonna say Travis Kelsey's also 29. 32, you dude. He's playing good for 32. Ramchick is definitely old. Ryan Ramchick. I'm gonna say Ryan Ramchick is 27. April 22nd. 27. Vita Vea! I have to take Vita Vea. As much as I would have liked Marlon Humphrey or Ramsey, I gotta take Vita Vea. We get to welcome back to the squad. Let's see if we can actually get in a game now. Marlon Humphrey, Fred, Wagner. Who? Wagner. Dude, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna use her. I'm gonna use her Vita Vea the whole time. Ooh, dude. I have never done this. Let's go. Get right through him. Getting down on Frank Clark. He's throwing a lob. Nothing going. Third and seven. Dude, I've never done this before. 
Paul Rush got through him, and that's a pick. What? Dude, it, I'm I'm in his I'm in his grill. Justin Fields. Let's just let's just gunsling down. I'm not wasting any time. Oh, look at how wide open Delvin Cook is. He's butt naked. Breaks two tackles. Uh. Justin Fields having the best stat line of his career already. I'm I'm not not 20 cool. yards. First and 10. I want something deep, bro. Um. I'm going for it. I'm going for it all, baby. Go up, Claypool. That was greedy. That was a pretty good throw from Fields. For how deep that was. Oh, he's there. Oh, he's not there. What kind of throw is that, Justin Fields? You're the worst quarterback to ever play for Chicago. How? Who? Dobbins? Chill out. Oh, get up. Uh -huh. No. Not Thielen's old ass. Ooh, this is definitely single cover. This is definitely man. Go. Yes. Fields? Oh, my God. What a throw. He's out of bounds. Oh, fuck me. That was such a sick throw. Justin Fields just made the play of the season. Oh, he's going to do it again, though. Justin Fields. Oh, and OJ Howard drops him. <laughs> oh, my God. That was disrespectful. Dude, I wiggled horizontally. I didn't even stop and go. I literally wiggled. Dude, OJ Howard's about to have the game of his life. Another one to OJ Howard. Oh, my God. Got anything open? Oh, he does now. Big hit. INT. Oh, that was. That would have been the play of the game. Simmons, don't let. No. That was a one. He just one handed that. Yup, he's got to go for two here. He's being on bubble. What are you running? Oh, Dobbins does not catch it. And it's a five point ball game. Let's go. Claypool is so open. Unbelievably open. Uh, actually, I completely lied. OJ. Oh, we caught that! Byron Jones! Right in the middle of the field is a wide open Howard. Dude, he is basically my whole offense right now. I think I'm just gonna keep running this until he adjusts. Nope, there's Howard again. Interesting throw, but it's a first down once again. And there's Claypool, but naked! Let's go! Ooh. I'm just going for the world's greatest game with OJ. <laughs> oh! You see that little wiggle? I'm gonna throw a laser to Tyler Lockett in the back of the end zone for a touchdown with no time on this clock. Lockett, go up! Stupid. I'm homeless. Uh -huh. I'm homeless. I don't have a home. OJ Howard underneath. They can't stop him. You just gotta get the ball to the guy. Just give it to him in open space and he just makes the play. I dare this man to try and stop OJ Howard. You gotta jump it, or I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna get you every time. Oh, he has six receptions for 130 yards. Now we switch up his route. He's expecting that little out route, so we just set him on a wheel. It's just gonna dust everybody. Do I believe that? Probably not. Did I get him? Yes. <gasps> Don't you dare go all the way. It's kind of working. All right, let's see if we can hit him again. Let's see if he'll be able to jump it this thing. Holy shit! Wait, that got eight yards? I'm gonna keep doing that, bro. That's elite. Does he try to jump it early? No, but RB is wide open. Tyler Lockett gets his first reception. Now I hit him with the out route because he hasn't seen it. He's been seeing the wheel. He's been seeing the wheel. And there's the out route. Let's go. Open space. OJ Howard. He's, he, he's a beast. Holy shit. It's like a wheel of mutt stat line. Like we're trying to do a wheel of mutt challenge right now. He doesn't. He doesn't see it. We got him. OJ Howard. Get in. Oh, he's not in. Holy shit. He's powering forward, but he's not in. All right. We're just going to give him a little. Would a curl work here? I don't think so. I'm throwing it. Oh my God, it worked. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe that worked. Oh, he's so tired, he's out. We gotta throw to someone else. We'll throw Keenan Allen, who's gonna sauce it up 16 to 13. Have you ever seen something like that? I guess this is the kind of shit you'd see in Draft Champions, because you just gotta make up your own fun, you know? Because there's no X Factors. Corner route's not open. Digs not open. Game. Game, I gotta get a nasty pitch. Oh, he didn't let me pitch. I was about to throw the nastiest pitch. And Dalvin Cook on the draw. He had to commit everybody to the run because he's just been seeing it so much. Dalvin Cook's first touch. We're going OJ Howard on this wheel route again. It's, I feel like it might be a little too convoluted in there. Nope. Nope, it just works. It just works. For the goal from the three, we're running the fake. I don't even care. I don't care what he comes out in. I think we can see oh, oh my God, he might be there. Shit, darn it. It sucks that he caught it too because there's a touchback. I would've had him on the three. Ooh, running back is way open. Running back is really open. No. Am I 
gonna lose? Okay, we're gonna get there. Oh, darn it. I would have taken a fumble. He's out of bounds. Stops the clock. What did he do last time he did this? He was running like slants or something. Okay. There's a few things over. Uh -huh. What a loser! He might have given me too much time because it is OJ Howard's season. Oh my god. He leaves Keenan Allen open. That's only four seconds off the clock. He really thought about this defensive pick. Okay, big catch, seven seconds on the clock. Somehow caught that, I don't really know. We just gotta get a little bit closer and then we take one shot. We get a little bit closer, call our timeout, then we got one shot to hit that end zone, baby. Or we just go Claypool right now. Get up there, buddy! What? He didn't even get a hand on it? Bro, he had a shot. Hopefully he comes out in the same coverage and I can do that again. OJ. OJ, pitch it! Where's it going? Who's got that? What? Wait, what? Why? Why is he down? No, I had a sh I, I could have pitched it again at least. Justin Fields had 296 passing yards and two touchdowns. Look at this. Look at this freaking nature. 16 receptions, 213 yards, two touchdowns for OJ Howard. 84 overall in OJ Howard. But I need to see this final play. Dude, uh -huh. So what? They called this a 13-yard rush by Dalvin Cook. So I made the right throw. I guess an even better throw would have been Claypool because he's actually already in the end zone. But at this point, it was probably not possible to score a touchdown. I guess I could have tried to trek through and then trek through another guy. But I just wanted to say fuck it. So we throw the greatest pitch of all time. All right, boys, I hope you enjoyed. If you got any other good draft ideas, let me know. I probably won't make another one until they update this shit. Either way, that was super fun. I had a great time. I love you, boys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.